Hi, this is Julie with Beataholic, and I have just a really simple, fun pair of earrings to demonstrate how to make today. I often do videos and they involve really long, complicated techniques, and I sometimes forget that some of the most beautiful jewelry is just uh, very simple and easy to put together. So I thought I would do this video with the holidays coming up to maybe give you some idea of perhaps gifts you can make. I'm titling this the Malbec earrings because Malbec is a type of grape used, it's a type of actually purple grape used in wine making. And I thought that was perfect since this is a vine connector from Tierra Cast. And then this is a crystal iridescent purple pearl from Swarovski. Very simple to make this. You know, I have the components right here and it just involves an earring hook, the vine connector, the 10 millimeter pearl and a head pin. One thing that's really nice about this project and to keep in mind is with the pearls, the head pins and the earring hooks, you'll get enough components to make five pairs of earrings. So perhaps you just want to buy a couple more of these connectors Two come in a lot. So if you buy a couple extra lots for just a couple bucks each, you'll be able to make multiple pairs of earrings. In terms of the tools you're going to need, you're going to need a cutter, or I have these wire looping pliers that I love. I'm going to show you how to use them and a pair of chain nose pliers. These are really quick and easy to make. So I'm just going to take my pearl, and this could really be any bead you want. I just happen to love this new color from Swarovski. I just put it on my head pin. And I'm going to take my wire looping pliers. And what's nice about these is they do some of the work for me. I'm just going to squeeze. And you can see that just made half my loop for me. And then I'm just going to rotate. Now what I'm doing is because I'm making a wrapped wire loop, I want to slide my connector into this loop before I finish my wrappings. So I'm just going to go like so. And now I'm going to take my chain nose pliers, close that loop back up. And on this one, I did a little something different than a traditional wrapped wire loop just to add a little extra element. I just made a swirl. It's really easy to do. I'm just going to hold my loop like so. I'm going to make my wrappings. And now I am just going to get that connector out of the way, continue holding it and just continue wrapping, really coiling that wire around the top of the pearl. Just like so. And this is a 21 gauge head pin. So that wire is going to hold its shape for me. I'm just going to snip off the little end that I didn't fully wrap. Get rid of that wire. So this is what we've got so far. And now there's a little open loop at the base of my earring hook. These are long, elegant earring hooks. I think they're actually quite pretty. And now I want to make sure that that little rough wire end is at the back. So when I put this on, I'll make sure the good side is facing forward. And now I'll just close it up. And I've just completed an earring. So you can see that was really quick and easy. Here's my earring set. Again, these are the Malbec earrings. The full ingredient list along with the instructions is available at beataholic.com.